to this. Welcome to our coverage of the final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Gray, sitting here on the commentary gantry, and with me to provide expert analysis, a complete tactical breakdown, is Stuart Robson. What a match this promises to be. It's Spain against England. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what an occasion this should be. It's going to be tense, it's going to be tight, but it's also going to be dramatic. It should be a terrific game. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Here's the lineup for Spain. Fabian plays with Rodri in central midfield, and Morata is the main striker for this match. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Kieran Trippier starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Jude Bellingham starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. A chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. No match for a well organized wall. Kane. Phil Foden now. And space available inside. And choosing finesse. He might be wishing he hadn't. Well, it's good vision, but not the skill to match, I'm afraid. Well, they have a real ace up their sleeve in Pedri. Interested to know what you think he might produce today. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Well, as we know, Spain have a very rich pedigree when it comes to the European Championship. Winners in 1964, 2008 and 2012. And this current crop, you've got to say, must be in with an excellent chance of prevailing in the final. Well, I have to say, I've been really impressed with Spain. I thought they might come to this tournament and play possession football without any penetration, but that's not been the case. They've been good at the back, they've dominated in midfield, and they've been a threat every time they go forward. If they play at their very best today, I think they're going to be European champions. That's a good-looking ball. It is Alexander Arnold making a bit of headway. Can he do it from miles out? Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Oh, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw it here. A decent looking attack this can they forge ahead excellent block well goal kick just as it was looking promising It's 
to Brazilians in the end, that's all that matters. Alexander-Arnold passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Whistle is sounded for half time in this game. The two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Covering possession well. We're getting the ball forward. But timely defending when it mattered. Okay. Since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. And Bellingham. Ball over the top. England doing well to regain possession. Morata. And he read it well, intercepting it. Cleared away comprehensively. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Trent Alexander Arnold. And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. What can he do with it now? Morata, element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Being pressed and pressed high. And Spain regaining possession. And that puts them in position. Well, oh, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Decided that now is the time to go to the bench. remaining Declan Rice Foden really good challenge
Declan Rice. And Kane comes into the move. Good looking attack, this. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. And the counter attack came to nothing. Here's Luke Shaw. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw it here. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. And they push ahead at the closing stages. And Bellingham. Oh, great defending. Torres. The inside route looks promising. Can he put them in front? Keeper did his job to begin with. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Harry Kane. Nice with it. Defending. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And the flag has gone up, offside. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. That's a good ball. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not over, and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength-sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Carvajal. It's with Laporte. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Tremendous challenge. Ball played nicely. He continues his run. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Declan Rice. In possession, Bowen. He has teammates around him. And foul it is then. And the keeper grabbing hold of that free kick. Torres. Ran it superbly to take back possession. Alexander Arnold. And teammates to play it to the ball more than decently but can they take the lead superbly read and executed well breaking at pace is always a possibility well read to put an end to that attack half time in extra time and Away they go again. Second period of extra time has commenced. Michel Marino. 
exploiting the wide area. Declan Rice. In possession, Bowen. England unable to hang on to the ball. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. Tidy ball. Can they forge ahead? No! And all because of the goalkeeper. Margins, margins. Well, he has done well there, but he should have won the game. They probably won't get another chance now. Jared Bowen. And Bellingham. Very quick thinking there. Closed down straight away. And the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Well, a fantastic final, and it's going to end in the most... And this will test the mentality of any footballer. And he scores! And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. And he's taken the low road, beautifully done. Can he get the better of the keeper? I must say, that takes real confidence. Brilliant. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. Well, it's all about keeping a cool head. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. In it goes. Can he remain calm? And he's denied them from the spot. And now a heaven-sent opportunity to... And there it is! That brings it to a conclusion and a contrast in emotions. One team joyful, the other absolutely devastated. Well, what drama, what scenes and what a good finish to this game. It really has been exhilarating. Well, in football, you don't forget these moments in a hurry. Due reward for their persistence and their overall excellence. Well, it really has been engrossing today. Such a tight game, but you have to feel sorry for the losers. They were so close, but yet so far away. And the party mood has enveloped the stadium. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. And now, with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, England! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. And it doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament.